when a doctor has told you you're going to die. What can you do if you want to know why? When you've conquered the grief and you've finally stopped crying, you may ask, why must it be me that is dying? When treatments and procedures and options exist, I'm willing to try these things, let's take the risk. With six months to go, every moment is precious. So why must I wait for palliative measures? If there's one thing that can help the terminally ill, Treating them earlier certainly will. By not taking the time, you increase the burden on the people whose lives are already uncertain. Precious time to think. Precious time to speak. So why only 15 minutes, once every three weeks? Clinical trials should be open to all. Not hidden information behind a paywall. Just openly speak about the trials that you run. Who, what, when, where, and the patients will come. When you obfuscate, hide, and delay information, patients die in the dark and filled with frustration. Just be open to think. Pick up the phone. Don't leave them to die in the dark, all alone. Perform those extra scans. Use the latest tools. Help to discover what's best within the rules. What can the dying possibly do when you lock the information away behind you? The information you provide to the subjects you study. Put it online. So it helps everybody. Where, when, who, how, how to sign up if you'd like to join now. Open the doors and open your minds. Let's leave those ivory towers behind. Let's join in together as part of the team. Doctor and patient, respect and esteem. The future is here, but not evenly spread. And at the end of the day, that results in more dead. For those who are dying, for those who need hope, let's remove from your dictionary one single word, nope.